Hey, what's going on guys? It is Dynasty, and I'm back bringing you another Grand Theft Auto V Future DLC video. Now, what I got for you guys today is some juicy information for some upcoming DLC for GTA 5 Online. I think I already said that, but uh, nonetheless, uh, we got some new images for the upcoming vehicles in GTA 5. Now, if you guys do not know what I'm talking about, a couple days ago I made a video on this. There are three new vehicles making their way in the upcoming, uh, either it be like a you know DLC pack or maybe a cars pack. And uh, these three vehicles are the Zentorno, the Massacro, and the Huntley. Now, uh, if you guys missed that whole video where I talked about that, I'll probably have a link to it in the description. But nonetheless, we got some new images of what these vehicles may in fact look like. It turns out that the guys over at GTA 5 forums doing their, uh, you know, their usual work going into the game's coding and files, and they pulled up some great images. Now, these are the images of what the vehicle will look like in terms of like all the customization options. They went into the last patch and they found this, so it's not the full image of the car, but it is kind of what you can customize. So as you guys can see right here. BAM! There's the Pegasi Zentorno, and uh, it has the hood scoop, the skirts, the side panels, the exhaust, and the spoiler, and it looks like a sporty car. A lot of people are saying these are like Italian cars, somebody said this is like a Lamborghini. Personally, I have no clue what this is, but uh, I know it's really not too much of like the full body, but you can see what you're going to be able to customize here. So, I mean, it looks kind of like an Entity 2 in, in a sense, because it has like those, uh, towards the back, those uh, like little pipes, and then like, of course, the front, the hood, and the side skirts. So, it does look like a sports car. It's probably going to be a supercar. Nonetheless, it looks really good. Along with that, we also have the uh, Massacro. It has the hood, the roof scoop, the front and rear bumpers, the skirts, the spoiler, the exhaust, and uh, in front of the fenders, you can see there it has like those little like racing little uh, things there that are in front of most of the fenders. A little like circular thing there, but uh, it looks a lot more of a uh, you know customizable vehicle. Looks like it even has a roll cage in there, and this kind of looks like a Corvette in uh, well a, cor a Corquette in uh, GTA 5 as they call it. But uh, this kind of looks more of like just a regular sports car, not necessarily a uh, you know an advanced. Uh, supercar but more of a sports car and uh, last but not least we got the Enos Huntley now you guys can clearly see this is an SUV because you have like that roof rack on top and it also has the hood and uh, I mean clearly it's gonna be like that SUV and if you guys do not know what the Huntley is it's actually a vehicle from GTA 4 and it kind of looks like a Range Rover but a little bit more sportier so I'm really excited to see these as a matter of fact I probably have some more image on the screen right now so you guys have a better idea of what these cars will look like BAM Someone on the GTA forums actually drew this out. This is the Massacre right there. And to give you guys a better look of what the car probably is going to end up looking like. And it does look like a pretty sick car. It looks sporty and I've always been a fan of sports cars. So anyways guys, this is all courtesy of the guys over the GTA 5 forums. If you want to read the full forum post, I'll have a link to that in the description. There's a lot of uh, cool stuff I think you guys will be interested in. And off of looking at what we got, it seems like we're going to be getting a, of course, like a Range Rover type of SUV. We're going to get a sports car. And uh, of course, the uh, the one that we're all looking forward to, the Zentorno, looks like it's going to be one hell of a supercar. But nonetheless, guys, that's really the point of the video. And before I go, I want to say uh, I completely forgot to mention this a few weeks back when they did go ahead and boost the crew count. A lot of you guys past you know a couple months have been asking me like, Dynasty, can I join your crew? Uh, I have a link to my crew in the description of the video. You guys can join. I had 300 members and that was the cap, but of course now the cap's a thousand. I think we're somewhere around 400 members. So first come, first serve. I play on the Xbox 360, so if you're a PlayStation 3 guy, I'm sorry, but I don't think we'll be able to play too much. Uh, but uh, if you are playing the Xbox 360 and you want to be in the crew, be sure to join the crew. Of course, the link to that will be in the description. And if you did enjoy the video, be sure to drop a like, leave a comment, subscribe for more GTA 5 content, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.